Hello friends, here we get the new software update in Windows 10 version 21H2 and before installing an update make sure that turn on the charging of your laptop you can see 2 hour 33 minutes remaining it is around 88% but you have to turn on the charging of your laptop for software update so now I am going to turn it on so here you can see 88% available and it is now plugged in ok now after it I am going to check this here you can see over there if we go in home I am showing you from starting if I go to settings and in settings if I go in update and security so you can see on top you are up to date but here we get the optional quality update available you can see here is the optional quality update available 2022-08 cumulative update preview for Windows 10 version 21H2 for x64 based systems KB5016688 ok here you can see and if you want to know more about this update just click on learn more and here if we go in Windows 10 version 21H2 update history so you can see August 26, 2022 KBE5016688 just click on it so you can see here you know more about this update you can see the highlights it does is an issue that might cause some game installations to fail because of a licensing issue it does is an issue that affects the icon colors of the list in the search app Added sin an issue that might cause this error when you shut down or restart a device. Address is an issue that cause Microsoft Edge to stop responding when you use IE mode. This issue also prevents you from uh, interacting with a dialog. And address is an issue that cause a uh, subscription activation to fail under certain conditions. And here's the improvements you can see this is the known issues in this update you can see this is the known issues in this update over there how to get this update this is the install this update instructions and this is the file information you can uh, know more about this update here okay so now and guys the size of this update is around 700 MB okay now after all this just close this window and you can see optional quality update available okay when you are ready to download and install this update download and install it okay so now i am going to download and install this update so just click on download and install so you can see downloading start guys it might take some time because the file size is big So you can see downloading 1% Okay this is a really good thing It is going fast and good speed So you can see 50% completed in just 1 minute and 21 seconds. So you can see it took uh, 3 minutes and 15 seconds. You can see downloading 100% completed over there you can see. I am waiting when installing screen will appear. Okay, it is uh, taking too much time you can see it took around 2 minutes and 37 seconds so guys you can see installing over there you can see installing screen appear and it is also going good you can see this is also going good you can see 21 to 45 and here you can see 70 okay this is a really good speed you can see it took only 10 to 15 seconds so this is a really good thing you can see installing 100% completed 
this is a really good thing i never seen this a good work this is a good work by microsoft hope it will not again start from zero okay guys this is a really bad thing you can see again start installing again start here you can see this is this is a really big bug i, I would like to say this is the major bug available in a microsoft update process here you can see installing again start what is this microsoft what is this this is not good here you can see this is really bad here you can see again start from zero you can see installing 21 percent guys it might take some time microsoft this is a really bad thing So guys, you can see nine minutes completed and now installing move at uh, 45 percent. You can see installing move to 45 percent. I hope it will uh, again directly move to another big number. So you can see, guys, yes, installing at 73 percent. So you can see, my prediction was right. You can see. It again moved to a big number which is 73 installing 73 percent completed I just want to Microsoft that uh, I want to know why it again started from zero this is a really big bug this is a major bug available in Microsoft update system please it's my request fix this as soon as possible so you can see installing is moving so you can see installing is moving 78 percent you can see okay now speed is going good so here you can see the reinstallation process uh, took around 15 minutes and here you can see i get this options restart now and uh, schedule the restart you can also schedule the restart guys after restart this update will stall and uh, the restart will take around three to five minutes so you can see community update preview for windows 10 version 21 h2 for x64 based systems kb5016 8 is ready to install you can see status is pending restart just restart now and schedule the restart to install this update okay guys thanks for watching if you have any query to this video let me know in comment section below please like share subscribe and click on bell icon for latest updates